but uh, this is how the land lies. Two matches apiece then. It's going to be a one match shootout for the spoils here in the opening match of Group A in a match that's really pivotal because given the strength and dominance of the top seeds Indonesia and this tie is very, very important. The winner of this one will probably go through to the knockout draw quarterfinals. It's going to be Chi Yu Jen against Supanyu Avehingsanon of Thailand. Chi Yu Jen ranked 146 in the world. His opponent 54 in the world. And they have met once before. And the Thai got victory on that occasion. Here come our athletes. Chiu Jen leading the way. He met today's opponent four years ago in the Onyx Chinese Taipei Open. A match that he lost to Abahinsonon, who back then was the 13th seed. It was 21-16, 21-17. He'll be keen to avenge that defeat today against this man, Supanyu Abahingsanon of Thailand, world number 54. Just that one match over the years that they've contested, going the way of the tie on the left of your picture. Sorry, service, receive, you're serving. Okay. So Chai Yu Jin electing to uh, stay on the far side of the court. And having someone throwing him into bowl first, so it'll be Chai Yu Jin who serves first from the far end. 24 years of age. Here's Chi Yu Jen. Number 146. Just six spots off of his career high. From the uh, Chinese Taipei capital. 1 metre 67 he stands. Look at that. Two matches all. Is his opponent today, former top 20 player, who's been as high as 19 in the world in January 2019. 31 years of age. One meter 81 from the Thai capital, Bangkok. He was a men's singles gold medalist at the 2011 Summer Universe Universade. This year he's 0-2 in singles. Born in Bangkok, 5 foot 11 effectively is uh, 1 meter 81. He's ranked down at uh, 54 in the world at the moment. Seamus Halpin. The umpire and the service judge, Jörg Huppertz of Germany. Jürgen, I should say. Yeah, so far, Averhingsen on. Well, he was the uh, champion at the Spanish Masters in 2018. That was a Super 300 level, where he down Rasmus Gemka in the final, 21-14. And uh, BWF Grand Prix level, he's twice been a, a runner-up in the Indian Grand Prix of 2010 and the Vietnam Open of 2017, where he lost out to Fed Pradab in the latter. This coach looking on keenly. This is massive. The winner of this one really ought to go on and become runners up in the group. Group A, the group of death, as it's been named by many, hosting the top seeds Indonesia, the 13 times Thomas Cup champions with Chinese Taipei, Thailand, and Algeria, the Litleys in the group, if you will. So, this suddenly 
Take centre stage with a lot on it, match five. We thought it might come down to it. Chinese Taipei having won the opening two, but then being denied the last two. Ladies and gentlemen, on my Here we right, go. Thailand. A one match shootout. And on my left, Chinese Taipei, represented by Ji Yu Yang. Chinese Taipei to share. Look all. Wait. Well, a raucous support courtside at the back of the court. <laughs> Several of the Chinese Taipei team are already on their feet, roaring with delight. Just trying to get behind their 31 year old man. Oh, nicely done. Showing a great deal of composure. Chiu Jet. Avahingsanon's made the quarterfinals of the Thai Masters last year. And 15 first round losses though, three second round showings over the last couple of years. So you sense that Avahingsanon's kind of in the twilight of his career at 31 years of age and the rankings sort of dropping a little at 54 in the world. It's going to be a tough ask today against this young, rampant 24 year old Chiu Jen. But who can cope with the pressure? Do you put your eggs in the basket of this man, have a hint to not? He's been up to 19 in the world a couple of years ago, back in January 2019. Well, with all of the rampant support from Chinese Taipei so early in this match, you kind of sense that there is a smacks of desperation a little, said respectfully. And they're trying to get behind their world number 146, Chi Yu Jen, the 24 year old. With every point that he wins, it's to bolster his psyche. But he's bringing a lot in attack so far. Three point cushion for cheap. Now you've got to really embrace these moments, haven't you? You can't be threatened by them. You've got to accept it as a challenge and look at it positively. A chance to really go after victory. And your opponent's not just going to lie down and make mistakes. You've got to really get at it. It's all about the mindset. Embracing the moment nicely. Six, 
But a 6-3 advantage to Chiyu Jen at the moment. Oh yes, keeping on the front foot nicely. Chiu Jen. Playing some bossy badminton right now, calling the shots. Still early doors, but he's a five point cushion. And <laughs> so keen to get behind him. Fervent support from the Chinese Taipei team. Did he make that? Did you know? Wow! How's that for a cross snap? <laughs> Loving the moment. Look at that beauty from the Thai athlete. But that was bettered. He could barely believe it's crossed the net, you know. Spellbinding badminton here in Orus. Well, that was for six in a row. Perhaps just snatching at that somewhat. Easy to do, I'd imagine. Vaulting forwards with all that he had. Now I can have a Hingson on settle down and rebuild. No, he can't. It's Chiu Chen who bullies his way to the mid-game interval of game one, 11 points to four. Thanks, some really commanding badminton after six minutes of action. It's Chinese Taipei on top of the early stages here. Well, at this stage, it's a tough one to call, isn't it? To go with a man that won their only previous head-to-head. -head. This man here. Or was it so long ago that it doesn't really matter? 2017 it was, back in June. But the Onyx Chinese Taipei Open, where he came through in straight games against this 24-year-old. Yu Jen. Chi Yu Jen is much improved.
Good pace on the return of serve. Does he believe at the end of the day? He's the world number 146, that he can really do this. This would be a big upset for him. He's the world number 54. Approximately 100 or so places between them, favoring the tie. You see in the odd unforced error creep into the game of Chiu-Jen. <laughs> it's a nerve-riddled deciding match, put it that way. Unforced errors creeping in either side of the net. Oh, he's found it. Beautifully done. From over Hinksamon. Keeping the sting in his attacks. And nibbling away at the deficit. He was 11-4 down. And he's done really well to haul this back. Very well played. Big opportunity for this young man to make himself a bit of a star today. And given the dominance of Indonesia generally, it's assumed that they'll win most of their matches. It's going to be tough, of course it is, and it might not be so, but... With Algeria being probably the weakest in the group, you've got to say that this is for quarter-final spot, really. And it all has come down to this, and that is wonderful badminton from Chiyu Jen. And I guess you ask yourself how much exposure he has, this young man in red, to practicing with the likes of Cho and Wang Sue. To gain that belief and experience. Just missed. You'd imagine this 24-year-old has to win the opening game here against the player that he's lost to before, and albeit four years ago. Psychologically so important against the man that's been right up there in the rankings. Keeping up the sting in his attack is Chiu Jen, that's for sure. Seven point cushion, four points away from winning the opener. Things really looking up for Chinese Taipei right here.
Yeah, super smash. Body language looking good, looking composed up together. And finding his spots right now is Chiu Jen. Chiu Jen from Chinese Taipei rips through the opening game. Just quarter of an hour, all he needs. He takes it 21 points to 11. Emphatic for Chinese Taipei in that opener. But a lot of badminton yet to be played. He's halfway home to what would be a really good win. <laughs> So it's a must-win game then for Supanyu Abihingsunon of Thailand to keep this tie afloat. Chinese Taipei just a game away from victory out here on Showcourt 1, day one. it all in his stride so far. Now it's he who can come roaring back, Abahingsanon, in this one. 
Many would expect that with his experience, having been a former top 20 player just two years ago, January 2019. He was ranked 19th, remember, if you are just joining us. Welcome along in the company of Paul Hand. Great to have you. Ball has been called wide. Yeah, he swallows it graciously. Thought he might have pulled the trigger on a challenge there. It was that close, but he obviously saw space.
Semis, Austrian Open, quarterfinals, Slovak Open of 2020, quarters as well. So he's a, a man on the up. Oh, that is glorious. Lovely disguise. Look at this, let's see it again. Backpedaling was the tie, look at that. High skill level from Chi Yujin. It's gone, good leave. He's everywhere at once. Chi Yujin keenly eyeing this one. Is ever Hinkson on? Where does he go from here? Hoping for a window in the clouds, an opportunity to snatch a run of consecutive points. He's so far only managed a couple of runs of three, and that's in game one. But it's you, Jen who has a five-point cushion heading to the turn in game two, and a game to the good. Things really looking up for Chinese Taipei right now. After two minutes shy of the 30-minute mark, they're in the driving seat, 11-6. Atmosphere building nicely here in the Senna's Arena in Aarhus, Denmark. This one match shootout to decide the winners of Chinese Taipei and Thailand in the Thomas Yen. Cup here. Xiu Jens wanting this one to be checked. He needs confirmation from Hawkeye. The beating heart denoting the tension of the moment. Right on the edge. ranking really is unrepresentative of the skill level of Chi Yu Jen, which is 24 years of age. He's uh, been as high as 140 in the world, this man 19 in the world. He was quick onto that though, wasn't he? The tie. Quickly put it into reverse. And he managed to snap some pop onto that one.
a wonderful cross net there from Supanyu Abahinson on really top point. Look at this, very high skill level, very deceptive, measured to perfection. Again, unable to engineer any more than a run of two in this game. Anyhow, out of Hinkson on. This game has been stifled and muted at the moment. Oh, do behave. <laughs> that was really nice from Chi Yu Jan. The back behind here, something very special. Look at that, clips that one down. Well done. He's uber agile, is Chiyo Jen at the moment. Live and sinewy. And he's moving with such purpose. Of Hingson on just trying to extend his stay, but been a lot to, to encourage the ties at the moment from him. lost their way didn't they Chinese Taipei haven't taken a wrong turn in the road two love up in the overall tie score and get pegged back to two all and suddenly it's anyone's now does this 24 year old Chi Yu Chen Chi Yu Chen have enough to get across the line he's six points away from victory as a Chinese Taipei with it and what would surely be a spot in the quarterfinals. It's all on the line in this one. Yeah, lovely cross smash. Cut it down really sharp as well. Is this where he makes his move? Have a hint on. Got a hold of that beautifully. Thank you. 
Just rushing his opponent into error. Chi Yujen closing in. Comfort cushion of five points to assist. Been a nervous performance so far from this young 24 year old. Oh, it's just gone long. Good leave from the experienced 31 year old Thai. So just gesturing, Super knew that he wants the court to mocked a little. And it just gives him a moment to catch a breath and take stock. As it does his opponent. Still being denied any more than two successive points this game. He's been managed well by Chi Yujen, who's uh, doing well to overcome that previous head to head loss to Ava Hingsonon four years ago. He's got it all under control, the man from Chinese Taipei, so far. Can he close it out? <laughs> well. Perhaps wanting to finish in the flurry with the tweener there. Three tie points in a row. Is this where he turns it around? Okay. Okay. He's taking his time. He's controlling the quarters over Hinson on now with his body language. And he's got a little bit of a swagger about him. He's been in this situation a lot of times over the course of his uh, career. He's 31 years of age. All a top 20 player. missed 16, now that could be a very big expensive miss for Chi Yu Jen four points in a row from Supanyu he's closing the gap fast from Chi Yujen. That was a massive point and somehow the 24 year old in the red shirt managed to get out of jail here. Very well played. And that was a much needed point from Chinese Taipei fans perspective having lost the previous four. Can you build from here? Five out of the last six have gone 
the Thai way. Blistering pace from the 31 year old tight. Now the Hinson on with an injection right here. Just buckling Chi Yujin into error. A deadlock in game two. Who's going to blink first? 18 off. Play. The Hinson with six out of the last seven points. He's got the momentum. And the cushion of 17-12 for Chiu Jen suddenly is no more. A little lucky nibble off the top of the net court there as well, helping the ties. Terrific rally from both players. Just look at this skill level here. Rolls the dice, finds that. Really well played by Chi Yu Jin. really is palpable around the Sarah's arena right now so many people so invested in this the tie hangs on this match two matches all and this to decide it can this 24 year old from Chinese Taipei get across the line the experience David Hinson on have something else to say about it. Oh, electric pace from Supanyu. Have Hinson on. And what a reaction afterwards as well. He's done really well to turn that 12-17 five-point deficit around in game two here. He's shown his character, determination. Game point here for the time. Denied.
deep breathing from the coach. Oh, he's found it. He's pierced the line, or has he? Understandably, Ever Hinkson on immediately throws his arm in the air from his flawed point of view. Out of desperation, we're going to get it checked to no avail. Well, remember, Abba Hinkson has had a game point. It's slipped through his fingertips. And he's toweling them down, so no more can slip through. But it's now a match point opportunity for Chi Yu Jen of Chinese Taipei. Oh, it's missed. Well, he wants the court attendant on, and he deserves that. Huge moments. One match point. Chi Yu Jen Hat. And that's now gone as well. And it's a second game point opportunity for Sopanyu Avahinson on now. Oh, yes, such pace. Lace that with chili. So much heat. These two really embracing the moment. So two game points have come and gone for Ava Hinton on, and we go on. It's going to be a second match point opportunity for Chi Yu Jen. Did he really do that? A service error at that stage. Two match points have wriggled through the hands of Chi Yu Jen.
That's wonderful play from Abba Hinson on the body jammer, just handcuffing Chi Yujin in the end. And now, will it be third time lucky on this hat trick of game points for Abba Hinson on? It's a titanic effort from 12-17 down in game two. Supanyu Abahingsanon turns the game his way and keeps the tyre afloat for Thailand. Saves a couple of match points and snatches the game on his third game point. 25-23, somehow he is all smiles, he's still afloat, can barely believe it. We go on, it's gonna be a one game shootout in a couple of minutes. Don't go anywhere. เวลาเขาจะตีข้างนอกเวลาเขาจะตีข้างนอกเขาจะเคาะลงเขาเลยลูกเกมไปลูกอยู่แล้วเล่นไงเสิร์ฟรับเสิร์ฟที่ดีแ
I would take a good look at these two men right now in the heat of battle. What are they made of upstairs? It's that mental toughness skill that becomes quite apparent about now. Well played. Lovely cross smash. Nicely done. Clipped away with authority. This all Asian affair has come down to the wire. Found it. Gorgeous straight smash. Hit with such authority. Got behind it so well. Look at the steepness of it as well. Got up so high to the contact point. of the time, longest match of the day so far. Just over an hour, we head into the second hour now. Can't take your eyes off it for a second. And such patience and diligence, hasn't he? Sapunio have a hint on.
Oh, it's hands down from the lines judge. And there is no challenge from the younger man. Precision defense from Abahinson on there. to his knees after that. He can barely believe it. Done so in jest. But still, the point is making. Seems cruel, doesn't it? Sometimes the service rule, but uh, there we are. Above one one five, that was deemed. And we move on. Great defence from Abahinson. Errors starting to come from Chiu Jack. Always missed it. Another unforced error from Chi Yu Jen. And after what he's been through, you can kind of understand it. Have a Hinkson on. Breaks to the front. 11 6 to the turn. He goes. Ty Hopes on the up. throughout is Evan Hinkson on. He's got the bit between his teeth right now and he's determined not to let go. And he's got his opponent in a stranglehold and is tightening the grip. Seven from the last eight points he's now won. Experience over youth starting to show. Cries of delight from the ties.
Oh yes, blistering badminton. From Sapunyu, Abahinson on. Very special. Yeah. Getting hot under that hat. Got to guard against complacency, there's no doubting that. Tai coach just uh, perhaps a little too vocal during the point. Instructed to keep it down. Good leave, really gutsy, backing himself. Thumbs up from Abba Hinson on. Chi Yu Jan in this deciding game so far, no more than two consecutive points. Abba Hinson on. He's managed a run of five already and a run of four just behind that. So he's right on fire. Another good leave from the experienced 31 year old. Oh yes, mixing it up beautifully, he's fist pumping now, looking very confident, swaggering around the court with real authority. He's played this match at his pace. Mentally, he's been standout. 12-17 down in game two. He kept on believing as Abahingson on. And he's three points away from Thai victory.
Is there another twist in the tail here? Well, the radar is right off at the moment for Ever Hinkson on. OK, to be fair, that was a, a string break, that's why. Actually, no, it wasn't a break. Nerves jangling a little. shot from the heavens right there from Abba Hinkson up as he closes in now on what would be a very sweet victory look at that very well played Just over an hour and a quarter, Supanyu over Hinkson on, has eight match points. on has pulled a rabbit from the hat today on day one coming through in three close games having been down a couple of match points he's turned it around and team thailand have dug themselves out of a hole from love two down in the overall tie coming through 11, 21, 25, 23, 21, 12. After an hour and 18 minutes of spellbinding badminton. A determined and characterful showing from the former world number 19. A titanic effort to turn it around in three very close games and fending off two match points. And well, spare a thought for the man up front here. Chi Yu Jen, who had a terrific day but unable to get across the line. That was just a, a very, very entertaining encounter. So, Team Thailand in the Thomas Cup coming through and take a big step towards the quarterfinals today with that win. And uh, I think Sonon dismantling and taming the young 24 year old upstart from Chinese Taipei. And they went love two down in the blink of an eye but he found a way through the 31 year old Supanyu Averhingson on 21-12 in the deciding game the ties come through the tie against Chinese Taipei 3-2 having been loved two down Cho and Liang and Wang Qilin won the opening two matches for Chinese Taipei but then it was Thailand that won the last three courtesy of Kunlavut Viditsan 
and uh, Kedron and Poivronucro, and then lastly, Ava Hingson on. So, what a day to get this uh, Total Energy SPWF Thomas and Uber Cup finals underway. The tie belongs to Thailand, and they start the opening Saturday with a Group A win. Well, this is up later from the Yuba Cup. Any moment now, in fact, Japan take on their opponents in Group A. That'll be coming up shortly. Thanks for your company from Paul Hand. I bid you farewell for now. You've got Trevor Harris's company up next. Bye for now.